up your hair. But I'm not going to do that since, like, I don't know. I'm just not going to do that. And so now you're going to take some regular foundation and just, like, place them everywhere on your wig. Okay, so after you've done, after you put your liquid foundation all over your face, now you're going to take some powder makeup and just place that all over your face also. Okay, so after you've finished powdering all over your face, now we're going to do the eyes. So now for the eye thing that I'm going to start out with, is I'm going to start out with mascara. Now you can take any take any type of mascara, I just put a bit mascara. Okay, so after you put on a lot of mascara, uh, you can't really see them, but I do have like a lot on, and it's really pretty off camera or off main laptop. So now for the eyeshadow, is whatever like whatever outfit you're wearing, which I'm wearing kind of a vintage looking dress, uh, you can just like do whatever color you're using. Just take some like eyeshadow. I'm gonna take the color I did white and silver silver in the video, but I think I'm just gonna take sand dust or sandstone. And then that's like the color. So yeah, I just finished that and if you want you can take some like glitter. I have green but it's up there. And you can just put it on there. Uh but I'm not going to because I have school in the morning and stuff, so yeah. Or and there's different colors that you can take this roller color. It's um a eyeshadow and it's like in a very light pink. Let me smell. I don't know. But yeah, I just did that and it looks pretty off camera. And then now you're going to for your eyes I mean for your eyes, no. For your um lips you're gonna take kind of an exaggerated color. Like you can normally do like lipstick. But I'm just gonna use like here's like an exaggerated color of lipstick. It's kind of like hard to tell on here, but it's kind of exaggerated, like lip gloss. Yeah. And now we're just going. I forgot to mention for your face, like it's best. Oops. Since I um creepy porcelain doll look, it's better to take some white and just contour it onto your face, wider than normal. If you can tell, like my chin looks a little bit wider. On camera. Too. So now we're just going to take. Also, you can take some, we're going to take some blush on our face because, like, it's easier. I mean, it just, I mean, it just gives it a more, like, vintage look. I'm using, okay, so I put all that with my cheeks. And now we're going to do the actual, like, stitches. So, for this, you're going to need some eyeliner. You can use liquid or face paint. So, now I'm just going to take my eyeliner in the mirror. Bring it down my face like that. Kind of like when you do that. It means that goes in. And now we're just gonna place If you mess up you can just wipe that off, but I'm not going to. So then you're also gonna do it on your lips too. Not the one. So like that. So thanks for watching guys, I'm not really doing a kind of complex one. Simple, you can 